line up for the final. Dudek on the inside in red. Dan Bewley alongside him in blue. Barton Schmalzik out of gate three in white. Leon Masson off the outside in yellow. Wow. We've got here. Yeah. We've had to be patient, but we've yeah, got yeah. here. We've, we've, we've waited for it, but I think it's going to be worth waiting for. It is going to be tense. It's going to be tight into that first turn. So, two Polish riders, a Brit and a Dane. So, an international lineup here. Will Dan Bewley blow the roof off by winning here? Either way, either way, I'll just repeat. That's Dan Bewley. I think they may okay, have just Dan Bewley. We can't hear ourselves think, but, that, but I can assure you that was Dan Bewley being introduced. Will Leon Madsen get away with another flyer? I don't think so. I think Mr. Steentoff may be wise to that now. He'll be watching him. And of course, uh, Bartos Marsden's not going to make it easy on that run to the first corner, that's for sure. So, it's been a roller coaster of a night. Four laps to go to determine the winner after a three year gap in the Principality. The final of the night then. Green light comes on now. Takes her up and we're underway. Julie's made a great start out of gate number two. Fires himself to the front. Roars down the first corner. Smells like now into second place with Dudek slipping back into third. Madsen didn't make it from the outside gate. Julie out in front. Looking like a winner from there for me. Absolutely sensational start. You said Chris, he had a smile on his face. And so it proved. Brilliant stuff from Beauty. Yeah, he had a smile that oozed with confidence as gate two became available. And he has taken this one, the ball by the horns. Look at him go. Whoa. Making the bike work perfectly. He's leaving Smiles looking his way. Absolutely. Out in front, just over a lap to go for Dan Bewley. Smarsley, the championship leader. That's no bad result for him. One last big effort for Bewley down the back straight. Here he comes. Listen to the crowd. Take him home. The winner of the Principality, Dan Bewley. What a ride. What a ride from that young man. This is a moment he will never forget. Absolutely right. Stunning performance. Absolutely jet propelled away from gate number two. What an a canter. Bartos Smarslik in second place. Patrick Dudek back in third. But the night belongs to Dan Beauty from Great Britain. He picks up 20 World Championship points, moving on to 64. What a night. And the first British winner in 15 years, Chris. We've had to wait a long time, but by golly, it was worth the wait. Yeah, his camp are going to be partying tonight. That was done so fantastically well. He made an electric start. He made the bike work in, the, in all four laps. He didn't make any mistakes, and he can rightly celebrate. Uh, look that down there with Steve Lawson, a man who really has worked tirelessly to get him to this point. Dan Beauty comes of age, so close in Gorgeoff, of course, last time out. But now his first final, and guess what? He's won it. Fantastic performance. Bartosz Marslik will be more than happy with 18 points, particularly as Leon Madsen has slipped back into fourth place, pick out 14, and Dudek on the rostrum with him. So for Smarslik extending his lead once again. Uh, good night for Smarslik. He's just showing his appreciation to the fans, but tonight. It's all about Dan Bewley, so accomplished. And there's Smarsnik showing his appreciation for what Dan has achieved. I thought he was going to give him a toe there to get the bike running. <laughs> He's eventually done it, but he Definitely started in really fine style, Chris. His first two opening rides tonight were just sensational. Just dipped a bit in his third and fourth rides, finished with the flowers in his fifth qualifying ride. But that ride in the final was something that was a sight to behold. And I'll say it again. A young man comes of age here tonight in the Principality. This place has just blown the roof off. I mean, crikey, can't get any louder. But this is a special moment, a moment he will never, ever forget. I don't think they're going to stop him going round, to be honest. I think he'll be going round till he runs out of fuel. The winner on the night is Dan Bewley. He's done it in wonderful style, delights the home crowd. And how about that, winning your first Grand Prix in the Principality Stadium at home? The last winner 15 years ago, and it's great to have Chris Harris, Bomber Harris, here tonight to witness it. I'm sure he's absolutely delighted for uh, that. He'll be the over moon for him. And uh, Steve Lawson told me this guy doesn't get excited when he wins a race. He seems pretty excited to me. Uh, rightly so. Yes, uh, I don't think anybody's going to uh, excuse that. But no, a brilliant moment for him. I'm sure he's going to make the very uh, most of it. It's going to take a little while to settle in, I'm sure, and just sink in exactly the achievement he's done. But more and more than that, 
he's now in the championship chase because he's rocketed to 64 world championship points. He's in the top six comfortably. And Dan Bewley, what a night for him. Yeah, this, this guy, how far can he go? He is just growing in confidence. It's great to see these young guys coming along. Jack Holder, disappointed not to make the final, but this is absolutely a fantastic result for the youngsters, and particularly that man there. And when he reflects on the fact that he shouldn't, you know, with the uh, suspension of the Russian riders, he wasn't even going to be here, so no, a remarkable no. moment. Dan Bewley won the final nicely. Bartosz Marslik back in second place, Patrick Dudek in third, and Leon Madsen didn't get the flyer he was looking for this time off the outside, <laughs> no, he and uh, he uh, finished fourth. But uh, the top three tonight, Bewley, Smarslik and Dudek.